Gandalf first the Balrog. Yeah. Um, I don't think that was what you were going to <laughs> like. Okay. You want me to reset? No, it's fine. Sorry. You know that it's cold gang, ho! I'll do like what I did last time. <laughs> well, when you line it up. So uh, where I put title cards, it's like, oops, I didn't hit record yet, and Dan did. So there's no video. Here it comes in three, two, one. That's less of a whoops and more of a, I just kind of went Trigger crazy. Happy. I'm just going wild. Yeah. Joker is wild. Jokers. I'm a joker, and I'm wild. I'm a no, you're not your two-face. Uh, wild card. Because the I cut yeah. the brakes. Hey. Do you know what's the best game to play with Jokers is Sequence? I like Sequence. Sequence is good. Yeah. Card game. Uh, boring. Sequence is a game that involves card, but I wouldn't really call it a card game. What would you it's call a, it? It's a board game. Oh. That uses cards. Emphasis to on play it. board. <laughs> How similar is Scrabble, or not Scrabble, fucking uh, Yahtzee fucking, uh, to uh, Craps? I don't know the rules to either involved. of those games, so couldn't you just tell you. that you roll dice? You just roll dice, and yeah, then you get a, has like a, a whole critical 20, and you yell Yahtzee. With it. Hmm. Hello, everybody, and welcome <laughs> to the What's All Time <laughs> podcast, where we're here to answer two questions. Uh, what, why is Sarah sitting on the ground and what is online? We'll do that. Is Phase 10 a game? Yeah. What is Phase Cards 10? Cards and dice. Oh. Whoa. Okay. I thought it was just fucking a weird statement. That should be illegal. <laughs> they shouldn't allow that. <laughs> I think I'm right. Tonight on the podcast, we have Daniel Ryan. That's me. We've got Matthew Harding. Yo. We have Ryan Pluck. Howdy doody. We have special guest Sarah. Hey. And you can tell she's very special because she gets to sit on the floor. And we have another <laughs> special guest, Snidney, who is also sitting on the floor, much like Sarah. He doesn't get a mic, though. Oh. You guys hear Matt's mic go crazy there for a second? Yes. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Matt, can you talk into that a little bit more? What? What? Why? What are you doing to me? Now Turn I can you hear up because you're very quiet. Yeah, we're going to hear you, dude. Yeah, yeah I could, you that's, you, Do we that's hear the huge, though, and I just go with mm-hmm. it. Sarah's uh, hell bent on being an agent of chaos, uh, giving, breaking all of my rules, uh, giving the mic to Sydney. Snidney. What yeah. other rules do you Snidney. have? Snidney. It's gonna, Is that it? What was his name before? Oh, well, yeah. Fred Durst. Sydney. Fred, Fred Durst. Durst. Yeah. <laughs> of Limp Bizkit fame. It was not. That wasn't. Was Fred that Durst before of, Sydney? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. No. Fred Durst of Limp Bizkit fame. No. <laughs> I've told you guys about the Fred Durst garbage story on here before, right? Yes. <laughs> it's still the funny. Dump that's named after him. <laughs> <laughs> That's Our dear society for performing arts. <laughs> that's what his parents say. <laughs> Stump that's named Fred Durst. <laughs> you guys, uh... Is he also the one who, like, wiped his entire Instagram and only has pictures of station wagons? <laughs> Was that what <laughs> Is that Fred Durst? I, that I know Corey I, Taylor, like, kind of went nutso and deleted, like, all of his stuff. Oh, I, I Fred Durst got bullied really bad for some political opinion that he was right about, and oh. so he wiped his entire Instagram and just only posts station wagons now. Yeah. I think it's yeah. him. Corey it's Taylor that's that's bullied just... out of his. <laughs> he's just been talking about being depressed for a long time, and then he does something like that, and everyone's like, "Whoa, what?" It's like he's been talking about being depressed yeah. for a long time. <laughs> what? I don't know. Why why do celebrities end up getting bullied on Instagram so hard? That's just really bizarre because you hear them like whine about it all the time. I don't use Instagram, so I is it even more like high maintenance than like Twitter and shit like that? Well, if you get uh if someone insults you on Instagram, a knife comes out of the screen and stabs you. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> yeah. Physically Fuck. assaults you. Okay, yes. that makes sense. Yeah. Oh man, I'm probably going to be like shiny by the end of this. Why? I'm warm, warmish. Oh, because you're drinking a spiked cider that Sarah made mm. and uh, beer Delicious. that Heineken made. Yeah. Mm. Thank you, Heineken. Thank you, Sarah. You're welcome. I didn't make it spiked. I just made it cranberry. I spiked it. Yeah. The cyanide. Touchdown. Yeah, like a blue shell. Because Kurt's the host, so he's in first. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it feels a lot of the time. Kaboom. So, how have you guys been the... This week we didn't record the last week because we had a uh, we had a bit of a COVID situation. Thanks, Dan. Dan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. On. Dan got AIDS. I guess. Yeah. No. I I did have COVID. That happened since the last time we recorded. It did happen. It's real. Yep. 
<laughs> Whoa. It's, it's not a hoax. <laughs> In case the president getting it wasn't enough to, <laughs> to convince you. No, that was just a media stunt. Yep. Uh, Trump is invincible. It was for votes. He's Superman. Haven't you seen the graphic comics of him and how strong he is in them? And how much wife fucking he does? <laughs> <laughs> does he fuck his own wife or other people's? Other people's. Mm. And, and they're like happy about it. Oh, uh, okay. So he, he, it's a really he cucks them. Right wing thing that's like. Huh. I, I can't tell. Can you describe. <laughs> is this like an actual comic? I've seen a lot of these. I mean, not like a lot, a lot, but enough to are be they like, different this isn't comics like one or are guy. they? Yeah, like it's other. Yeah, like I can't tell if they're fucking. Uh, what's it called? Like, like the hard times and the onion. Uh, uh, like a strip, oh. like a satire. Sat- parody. Yeah, I can't tell if they're satirical or if they are. I think actual like right winger, like super like neckbeard kind of guys making these comics that are like, like Trump is so cool that. There he goes off with my wife, and I'm happy about it because he's Trump. I'm sure at the very least it's a little tongue in cheek. I don't, I can't imagine that even the most like delusional. Uh, I mean, yeah, it's, right. it's meant to be over the top, but it still seems like it is right wing as far as like it's still centered around like because he's this cool. Like it's over the top, but it's sincere. Like that, I would, yeah, like, like born out of sincerity. Yeah, mm. like I respect that guy so much, I'd let him fuck my wife. That kind of thing. <laughs> I That's don't... the attitude put into these. I, yeah, and, it... and he's always drawn wow. like he's like a fucking like a wrestler. Like yeah, he's like super fucking. Buff he, he is a wrestler. Wide man. chest and like very <laughs> like, like always like an eight pack, and he's just like carrying her like the, shirtless, the perfect but body. Still suit pants. The perfect body, one would say. Yes. Yeah. 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 He's doing one of those. Well, no. So I mean. I would imagine there, if the person is completely sincere, then the audience is definitely not like reading this because they actually want Trump to <laughs> fuck their wives. I don't think that's <laughs> for all of our view- video viewers. Here's a uh, photo of it. I I kind of think I know what you're talking about because uh, it's like this kind of shit. Okay. Yeah. Send that to me. Ew. Wow. You like that, Ryan? Yep. I'll Jesus. put that in the video. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Look at that in all of its glory. I. So Trump has never looked like that his entire life. Nope. We talked about it. that's but exactly what it looks like, right? Era. Okay. All right. <laughs> No, he doesn't look like that. <laughs> yeah, can we get a, a our fact shit. checker in on this? I don't. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's weird because Trump is, he's tall, but he doesn't look like particularly in like good shape. No, he he's, looks I really very don't think unhealthy. we need to yeah. address his attractiveness, I feel like. I think yeah. this what is important, Sarah. Well, I'm just saying as far as like other presidents go, even like Joe Biden, like at least Certainly has good Certainly not posture. the hottest. <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> I think it's a valid <laughs> road of criticism when you're like, because I don't think people were drawing. Well, no, they absolutely were probably drawing Obama shirtless and fucking other people's wives. But that's not necessarily a political thing. That's just uh, a. He's, he's a shit it's ton his of own brand of cuckoldry. Just admiring him. It was like <laughs> Iron Man and uh, well, Mr. See, Incredible and Captain America, and Trump is just glowing in like the whole. See, the. the these look like Jack Kirby drawings. I thought, like, in the modern, like, comic book style is so, like, over the top and crazy anyway. Like, these look like uh, old school weird. <laughs> well, yeah, it's it's probably boomers making it, man. I, okay, yeah, I guess. <laughs> but even, like, old, like, comic book guys don't draw like it's this anymore, general, really. We're going to repeal it. We're going to replace it. Get something great. Repeal it, replace it, get something great. Like, why are those? That's not even that. That's there's been one of those. That's the chant, Daniel. That's that's very bizarre. That's what Hot Trump likes to chant. That's a shit chant. (laughs) Hot Trump. It's hot. (laughs) Nice. It it is him on a boxer. His face on a on Rocky. That's from Rocky. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's Rocky. (laughs) Is that Rocky or is that the? The guy that he fights in, like, Rocky 2. Because it looks like it could be that guy. Trump's photoshopped um, image of himself. No, that's definitely Rocky. Okay. That's <sighs> Sylvester let's Stallone get back, Let's yeah. get back on track a little bit. I know that we have a video out now, but we wait, don't... Wait, Anderson Cooper takes a look at President Trump's history of purchasing or photoshopping images of himself. He made this. <laughs> Trump <laughs> made it? Trump superimposed Damn, his Damn, he's really good at Photoshop. I think mean, he paid somebody. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, it, he does it in his spare time. He's like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. Mm-hmm. What spare time? He's so busy, Ryan. 
I, he does watch a lot thing. of TV. So. Yeah, and it's so on like Twitter he can a lot. Save the world. Yeah. That's true. So Dan got COVID. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. God damn it, Dan. <laughs> Exit off of this, Dan. We're done. We're done with <laughs> garbage. I'll just go on Facebook then. Okay. Look at the cheese. So Dan got COVID. You. This is kind of your story. Like, do you know how you got it? Do you know? Do you want to describe your symptoms? <laughs> If you want well, to I know how I got it. I don't know. I work in a restaurant industry. I don't do shit else, man. I <laughs> I go to work. I come home. I go grocery shopping sometimes. That's you it. You didn't go, didn't do any raving. I got it from being in a restaurant. Okay, that's, that's like the most susceptible crowd. That and like being in a hospital. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Restaurants yeah. are runner up, especially because our. I'm not gonna finish that sentence. Um, <laughs> it was Uh-oh. it was shitty. I fucking had chills and shit and. They're they're bad. The chills are the worst part, mm. I think. Well, no, I also dry heaved with a very empty stomach, like nothing even came out, yes. like not even Ooh. liquid, like it was just literally nothing. It felt like my stomach was a like empty. a balloon with a vacuum on the end of it. Like once already all the air is out of it, and there's still a little bit, but then like you suck it and like <laughs> gets compressed, like mm. it bloods. Mm. Is that kind of gross. feeling? Yep. Good, good ab workout. Don't get COVID. It was. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I that passed my mind while I was in. I was like, this is <laughs> this is a good ab workout. <laughs> it's terrible. It was one of the later things on my mind. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it was it's there. probably like, why Eventually. am I dying? First? I was trying to find one uh, fucking silver lining mm-hmm. to uh, uh, that was it. Literally not sleeping for an entire night before work, oh. which I obviously called off. Right, and. uh sleeping in the bathroom when i'm real sick i do that like if i have the flu i just bring a case of water a pillow and a blanket into the bathroom and <laughs> yeah, i chug smart. waters until it makes me vomit and then i vomit and then i take a nap and then wake up and repeat and then it sucks really bad but then i'll get over the flu in like a day uh, okay that's uh, <laughs> okay i'm like you're trying to vomit this shit out body let's do it let's do it here you go you need this dan let's has go. this one trick for the flu yes <laughs> doctors hate him yeah <laughs> <laughs> they do one time I went they there they would if you ever went to I see pass, I one, by the one out of ten doctors they, they, approve of Dan's methods. They like tap their <laughs> the other nine, like, so like, I'll get you someday, Dan. You know, uh, I'll get you to come in. Not here. to be mean, but I'm. I'm yeah, kinda, that's how I got COVID. <laughs> I'm kind of glad that you're. You're, you're like, try beating this with your methods. <laughs> I'm kind of glad your medical career didn't quite pan out because that. I don't People will walk in and I'm like, trust me. You know, <laughs> this. You know, you know, you know, you know, <laughs> This is the way to go. What? <laughs> I'm reading your chart. And it seems like you're just a little bitch. Go home. You'll be fine. <laughs> just walk it off. Hey, but uh, none of us in this in the Everyone house else tested negative. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 words. Yeah. yeah, words. That one. Yeah, good and, thing. And I, I got to stay home for two weeks. Half of which was I didn't. You s- dick was pretty stressful. Well, I didn't get paid for it, so oh, but. it wasn't like I had to use vacation time to kind of make it up. Make it up. Well, then you did get paid. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. When are you going to use that vacation time? Yeah, Kurt, you don't take vacations. You're a workaholic. I would I not see him all day going back to work to pick up extra hours. <laughs> I, I wouldn't. Um... Yeah, I just farted on Sydney. <laughs> oh, God. Now he's never going to leave. Not only am I like kind of upset about that sentence, it also didn't need to be added to the conversation. <laughs> you did immediately turn you, back you to the screen to, to throw that into Mike. Yeah. To like, it'll be great for the highlights. Oh, him farting on Sydney. <laughs> that is very unfortunate. See, now you're glad I'm sitting on the floor. At least I am. Uh, yeah. yeah, no, yeah. I would have been yes. fine with you being on the couch. Closer to your okay. nose. No, nose see, nose I'm closer to the candle That's... than I am anything. His ass and the candle are the same distance That's from your face. That's what's better about sitting on the ground instead of the couch <laughs> is that you are a little bit closer to the candle. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the benefit. Yeah. Well, if I'm very close, if I get like like a few inches away and then kind of squint, it's almost like I can imagine that I'm just at a campfire. You know? No. No. Like I'm at a campfire that I'm actually 15 feet away from. No one said this. You're making this up. I didn't say that. <laughs> I heard you it. said this was one of the benefits to sitting on the ground. I didn't say and I'm a little bit closer close to, to the candle. Shut up. <laughs> 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 That's not what I meant by that. I didn't mean, what did oh, you mean campfire. by that? It's like someone's burning a pine tree next to me. Lumberjack <laughs> <laughs> Sarah. <laughs> yeah. Burning <laughs> yeah. It's almost like Stupid I can use the Stupid lumberjacks, you take out your tree vengeance by cutting them down. I just burn them. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
that a post on Facebook. Ooh, somebody's burning a pine tree next to me. All right. <laughs> Dan's got a got a little tree. I do. It's behind the camera. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to take a photo because I'm recording on my phone. I'd spin it around, but I know you were like sitting there taking your time positioning that. Yep. Perfectly. I like how she tried to duck under the camera. And just <laughs> gave up right right it. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, oh, Sarah. Great. No more Goodbye, sitting on the floor. Goodbye, Sarah. No I guess um, <laughs> I guess the person who sang that song, the lady, Q yeah. Lazarus, right? She, yes, she oh. uh, she fucked off and just disappeared, and she had like a bunch of royalties. Goodbye, that... Q Lazarus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, they said that she probably went, I think, like to France or somewhere, and she just France. was hanging out with like drug dealers. So nice. Probably chopped up in, in a ditch somewhere. But they're like, if she ever shows back up again, we can. We got, got her royalties. What? What? Yeah, no, it's fucked up. It Spotify's keeping. I, them. I've heard this story why, a few why times. Why does she have to be like chopped up and dead in a ditch somewhere? <laughs> yeah, that, that's the part they got me. <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that's kind the of... dress. Someone went missing. That's probably what happened. <laughs> <laughs> what I always think happens. Damn. I wanted. Well, to... I don't know. I do, I do kind of agree with the like probably dead considering the reasoning for that train of thought. <laughs> is, 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 you... There is lots of money waiting for you if you just show up. Right. Right. Well, the usual saying is dead in a ditch, not chopped up and... I ash. wanted to put a funny spin on it. <laughs> nah, chopped up is the way to go. <laughs> it did have shock value. I was very... Yeah, we're like still talking about it. by that. Yeah. Good stuff. Yeah, yeah. do some more uh, comical things so we can, can talk yeah. for 15 more minutes. You know, they always say that, like, funny... Yeah. Um, you know, rape's not funny unless, it, unless it's uh, clown rape. <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah that's what everyone says I, I, i've heard i've heard this said before it's like but clown, clown rape's pretty funny yeah ha 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 but uh john wayne gacy isn't like particularly <laughs> hilarious <laughs> just what he did in his whole like situation he's got so, great makeup though yeah hmm? uh. he was a. Uh, Got some weird images in my head. You want a long form <laughs> oh, no. joke? So the Zodiac Killer's still at large, as far as we know. You mean Ted Cruz? Oh, oh, <laughs> but did you hear about uh, they broke the code? Oh, that's right. They had a Whoa. cipher. I, I, I did not click that link. Do you know? Do you know? <laughs> he spelled paradise wrong. <laughs> oh, not so smart anymore, idiot. Yeah, you can make a code that takes fucking what, like <clears throat> 30, 40 years to break? <laughs> And you can't spell paradise? Uh, so did they get leave what any... What a fucking a... dummy. <laughs> what a moron. What, what a, a fucking jagoff. What a stupid dickhead. What yeah. a... How do you spell what it? What a piece of trash. I... Yeah, they got Ted Cruz. <laughs> yeah, they got <laughs> <laughs> how'd they, How'd he spell it? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> oh. P A I R A D I C E. Do you know what the content of the cipher was? P-A-I-R hyphen... A hyphen D I C E. So what I just said, but with hyphens. Yeah. 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 Do you think the cipher said I'm gonna run and lose uh It makes it more like an Acme and, product. In Looney Tunes. In uh twenty sixteen. Wait, what? He you had think, a harpoon? Do you think the cipher said I'm gonna run for president in twenty sixteen and nobody'll know that I was the Zodiac killer? Paradise. Oh yeah. In my pocket still. Because it's Ted Cruz, that's a funny thing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this fucking raw Jokes. comical energy in this room right now is fucking overwhelming. It's this burning fucking pine tree. <laughs> so it's a long shot, but I'm gonna roll the dice. But he spelled it D I S E. <laughs> Damn it! When he talks, he spells out his words when he talks, but only That's if he smart. spells it wrong. <laughs> this is a this is a whole new Zodiac killer lore. Yeah, everyone. it's it's kind of like uh. Uh, Josh, what's his face from Drake and Josh? He repeats words for emphasis. Oh. Emphasis, but yeah. Ted Cruz just spells out the last word of the sentence. Oh, that shit's okay. so good, dude. Parrot, <laughs> gonna roll the dice. D I C. Did you hear about how um Drake Bell moved to Mexico? Yes. What? Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's, yeah, he's a famous oh, uh, Latin star there. God, what's his name? 
What the uh, fuck? It's not Drake Bell anymore. You know, it's, we could really use that fucking fact checker right now. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, what Matt, that's supposed to be you. I, you turned uh, around uh, twice for this episode. Uh, uh, Do you think uh, that Sarah like texted somebody to call her so that she had an excuse to get the fuck out of here? <laughs> she said, well, you guys are just ragging on me for five minutes straight now. So, so, so wait. Is Drake, Be- Drake Bell Mexico, people <laughs> still ask. <laughs> is what? Drake Bell the CEO of Taco Bell? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, that's true. Are these questions or, or they're facts? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's fact checking. <laughs> it's Drake Bell, the CEO of. <laughs> Click on that and see what it says. <laughs> see what it says when he drops down. He's been posting to social media entirely in Spanish and claims he's the CEO of Taco Bell. He claims that. <laughs> <laughs> Once prior to telling his followers he would only tweet in Spanish, it seems Bell also claimed he was the CEO of Taco Bell. <laughs> Oh God! As CEO of Taco Bell, I've added one of my songs to the sauce packet. <laughs> oh, my Drake God. Campana. Drake, Drake Campana. Campana. Yeah, C A M P A N A. Campana. I listen to it. Okay, so I listen to a lot of Latin music at my restaurant mm-hmm. because uh, why not? Because it's he- uh, it's a kitchen. Mm-hmm. Um, and, what, uh, what does that mean, Dan? I don't know. I'm white and I work in a kitchen. <laughs> but I am the minority. <laughs> but yeah, uh, so you know, I've I've acquired a light taste for this music. Yeah. I I don't necessarily throw it on all the time, but I do listen to it. Um, <laughs> oh my god! Just <laughs> by force. Can you can you guess what um, that last name means? Translates to Campana. Yeah. Bell. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, what the? His, his, his stuff's pretty good. It it's, is it's is it really? Good. Yeah. Yeah, like I listen, like I'm not gonna like listen to it all the time. I listen to it to see how it was, and it's not bad. <laughs> That's good hilarious. Stuff. Good because artist. it took him so long to like he, forever. He was trying to make a music career over here, and well, nobody he, was he really didn't biting. Move there to start the music career. That's just what happened because right. he fled the United States for abuse claims. Yeah. Oh fuck! Okay, well yeah. that's a lot darker than so I gotta get out of here. He's like Taco I'll go Bell be famous was all over Mexico. Instead. Yeah, I, I, apparently, owned Taco Bell. He still wants ties <laughs> to the U.S. Yeah. So I, he's, he's, he's like, I am Spanish American. <laughs> Taco Bell. What? <laughs> what is wrong? Drake with Bell it? is Tex Mex. <laughs> okay, Taco so I didn't hear Hannah. about the abuse claims. What? You what think was that? Taco Bell's in, in uh, he abused people it's all over the place, like uh, significant no, others. It's nowhere. Down okay, there. like sexually okay. or it's just a super American thing. Yeah. Domestic abuse. I, I, yeah, I believe that's. What Unfortunately, it was. I think so. Yeah, that I, is I that's know. a bummer. He's a fucking weird guy. You hear that he like was super salty that Josh didn't Drake invite Bell him to has his been wedding. Accused of abuse yep. by former girlfriend Melissa Lingafelt. Who goes by her stage he also name, found Jimmy a way. Ono. He found a way. <laughs> she spoke out against the actor in a TikTok if you, video. If you open up your eyes. On Wednesday. I don't know the rest of this It's going to take some time to realize. What? But if you do time, there so is a Taco fun. Bell in Spain, though. There's a Taco Bell in Spain. Yeah. So. The more you know. You Between yeah, they call it an American restaurant. <laughs> 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 I guess I get some American food. Let's get some tacos. Yeah. Like Taco Bell great. Great. Between Taco the two of them, you wouldn't have ever guessed that Josh Peck would end up being relatively like normal and kind of going gracefully out of the start. So wait, is he like <clears throat> Josh Peck just seems like a wholesome ass guy. Yeah, no, yeah. he's very nice. Like I, I remember he was an asshole. Hmm? No, that's Drake Bell. Okay. Yeah, that yeah, is yeah. definitely Drake. Like Drake got really yeah, mad. This, this actually sounds like a like, <laughs> like if it was an adult show, this is an episode. Oh, this was show. definitely, <laughs> definitely. Drake Bell goes to fucking. Yeah, it's, it's like always Sunny meets Drake and Josh. <laughs> it kind of is. It's like Josh, his, I got to get out of here. My ex girlfriend is abusing her. So mad at me. Got to get out of here. Let's go to Mexico f- and become a famous pop star. <laughs> Why the fuck would you choose Mexico? Because it's because right it's close. there. Yeah, I mean, it's it's because I think to. he is. Uh, he doesn't like the cold, I think so he can't go to Canada. White. Is he mixed? Mm, he's uh, white. It, I'm pretty yeah, I'm pretty sure he's just white. Drake Bell is American and was born in Newport Beach, California. Parents Very white. Robin he's white. Dodson and Robert Bell. Yep, grew Robert up in Bell. Orange County. 
That sounds very white. It's unclear why Drake has made the move to sing and post <laughs> exclusively in Spanish, but reportedly has a huge Latinx fan base. Yeah, because he's not it, bad. It's because he's the CEO of Taco Bell. That's it's really bizarre. Well, us. because like David like Hasselhoff has like that weird German thing, right? Oh yeah, he yeah, does. like he has a bunch of a German. German well, or how isn't it because he did like talk? dance music or some shit? He did some like German pop music. Yeah, that's I what think. I thought. Or he no, I think he made regular music and it was just popular over there. Like I think I don't think he was singing in German or anything like that. But they just happened to really like it. Hmm. Have you seen how Nicki Minaj <laughs> interviews in a British accent? Yeah, no. I no. saw that. But she's not dumb. British. Of she's course not. About just I just like the accent and the way it sounds. Oh, I remember wow. that, and that was so <laughs> s- dumb. It's like it angers me, but I don't. It shouldn't. Like I shouldn't care. But, like, I do. Like, just stop it, doing that. Yeah, no, yeah. don't. It's just fun to be going like this. <laughs> I do it because I'm obnoxious, and I think it's hilarious. But Maybe she thinks uh, the funny, same funny. thing. No. Yeah, she, there he goes. Maybe just her whole with career people. was a joke, but then it escalated. I mean, that would be pretty hilarious if, like, she That's doesn't. Yeah. <coughs> call him aging. <coughs> what? I, I, I didn't hear that. I, I didn't, yeah. You weren't talking into your mic. What'd you say? And Kurt was doing. So that's sounds. what Kurt's parents call him aging. What? I <laughs> said it was a joke and then escalated. Damn. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> Got him. I get the burn right, now. Bye. Goodbye, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> He's Sarahing. Damn. So, Am I the next to go? Because my name's Ryan. Could be. Could be. Uh-huh. All right. I'll catch you guys later. <laughs> Bye. I'm not going to get up, though. I know. <laughs> All right. I'm still trying to collect my thoughts on this. So <laughs> he's been tweeting. On, on which part? <laughs> just this whole <laughs> fucking thing. Like, tweeting in, exclusively in Spanish, saying he is the CEO of Taco Bell. Fled the United States due to fucking... Allegations. Yeah. This is just so fucking weird. <laughs> uh, I mean, people have fled for less. I, I you know? know. I guess it's just. I talked shit on Sarah wanting to sit on the floor, and it made her flee the room. Right? Yep. Yeah, she ran away. It wasn't all the way to Mexico. Though. No, no, she's no. just gone. There's no way she's still in that phone call. I think she's in her room. <laughs> right? Just like I don't want to do this. Yeah, actually, never mind. <laughs> Somebody she did, did say she was just gonna stand off camera and watch us. Yeah, and that would, like, that wouldn't have worked. Get on mic. <laughs> and she's like, I don't want to do this. Yeah. This is why I was going to say it. Off yeah. Camera. If you want to watch us, just, you know, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Mm-hmm. She Click didn't that even bring drink. damn bell to subscribe or whatever. <laughs> I don't know. What did they say for YouTube? Alexander Graham. Hit bell. that what? motherfucking That's like it. button. Yeah. Smash it. Smash that. We want to get up to three likes this episode. Subscribe. Let's make sure Whip that happens. Whip out happened. your willy and slam it down on the goddamn keyboard and bruise it. Yeah. Ow. And if you don't have a willy, do it with another part of your body. Boob. Uh, <laughs> forehead. I was thinking Pinky like your toe. finger. Weenus. Pinky toe. Weenus. <laughs> Weenus. Nostril. Yeah, do your nostril. Do the back of your throat. Okay. Uh, belly button. <laughs> Matt or Dan, you got any body parts? Huh? No, I'm trying to find something. All right. Trying That's to find those body parts. <laughs> the dick bone. Connected <laughs> to the dick bone. Wow. What? <laughs> I have a, a tibia. A what? Tibia. A tibia. Okay. And a fibia. A tibia. It means to be announced. And a labia. No. Okay. Oh, okay. Tibia. Tibia. Tibia announced. <laughs> Thank Tobias? you, Matt. <laughs> what? I said, Thank you, Matt. I don't think you got the joke, but you giggled anyway. Yeah, fuck that joke. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that joke. I was gonna have fuck to that joke. Open a zip fuck folder that just joke. Come on, guys. Fuck that joke. Fuck that joke. Fuck that joke. Fuck that joke! Fuck that joke! Fuck that joke! Fuck that joke! Who remembers? Fuck that joke! Who remembers? Fuck your facts! Fuck that joke! Fuck that joke! Fuck that joke! Fuck Ben! Cranberries got your tongue? Wow, Dan. Fuck those cranberries! Oh, dude. Uh, yeah, are we, uh, are we at the end? Uh, yeah, we any, still got time. Any first half plugs? Yeah, do you guys... Stick around for the second half. <laughs> Who's part it? two, where Who's we go the... into other stuff. Ah, We're going to talk man. about <laughs> movie theaters dying, Dan. Oh. Because uh, that's Because they, <laughs> they got COVID. <laughs> they got COVID. Movie theaters Can't did get stop. COVID. Yep. 
Yeah. Then the and then we we'll might talk about counting crows because I want to talk about counting crows. For some Who's reason. in the Christmas spirit? Oh, but we, we might talk, talk about, about even more interesting <laughs> things. You'll have to listen to the whole thirty minutes to find out. <laughs> Fuck. Sorry. Fuck that. Shit. It just it, it, shit. We'll be right back after these messages. After these. You, you know that it's cold, girl. All right, everybody. Welcome back to the What's Online podcast. Thanks. Hey. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Where no one's holding the reins and everybody complains. We 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 got all the guys still that were here before. Nobody holds the rain, sleet, or snow. Minus we Sarah. cancel the podcast for all kinds of reasons. <laughs> <laughs> but not on nine. <laughs> but not on nine eleven <laughs> last year. <laughs> Goodness, I still need to listen to that. That's the only time that we've actually impromptu, not on a actual podcast day, decided no, to do a podcast. To yep, that is very true. And if you want the 9 11 episode, email us what's online at gmail.com. Dot com. Dot com. Com. Dot com. I'll help you with that email. <laughs> I'll help you with the email. I was having troubles with my headphones. Oh, uh, as far okay. as like uh, getting the episode sent to people? Yeah. Sorry, cool. I didn't wait for you to. I can do that. I, I, you had the video going, and I was like, clearly it means he's all prepared. No, I did. Cool. Okay. Yeah. I like how the mask, like, it looks like you're... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty fucking sweet. For, uh, for yeah, those... my mask. For those in audio only... <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> audio only land, uh... <laughs> Brian's got a bitchin' mask. Yeah, I, I was not making a joke about like like this is my mask. I don't want to, like no. I, I wear masks all the time, just not in my own house. Yeah. <sighs> Still caught. I'm gonna kiss him later. So why do I need a mask now? I like how he backed up. He's like, whoa. <laughs> yeah, he said, whoa, whoa. later. <laughs> not right now. Not on camera. <laughs> now, that's why you put so much alcohol on the street. Now it's yeah. later. <laughs> well, I was wondering why it kind of smelled like uh, dick. Sleeping Love in the room. <laughs> Sleeping potion. <laughs> really? <laughs> that you got from a witch. Witch doctor. Yeah. <laughs> Sandwich. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Is that just a witch on vacation? Guys. No, that's if you put a ham and chloroform sandwich. Guys, oh, okay. guys, you're aware, of course. <laughs> Oh. That um, you're a wolf. Warner you're a wolf. Brothers is going to send all of its shit to HBO Max. They're like, fuck it. We don't give yep. a shit about the theaters anymore. Eat a dick. Well, they're doing both. They're doing both, but they're going but no to be one's doing going it. to a theater. Right. They're re- it's the same day release, I think, is what they're doing. Yeah. yeah. Wait. The, so, like, is they, it going to be on It's gonna be on Amazon? HBO no. Max, Matt. Well, HBO is on Amazon. Matt, Matt they're HBO still. HBO Max. HBO Max. I have HBO Max on Amazon. You okay, you can get a bundle. Yeah. Deal. Yeah, they they'll bundle them together, but let's watch okay. some fucking curb your enthusiasm. Fuck no. What? It's so dry. Whoop. Uh, yeah. So I think the first movie that comes out for that Warner Brothers or the uh yeah Warner Brothers is uh Mortal Kombat. So Mortal get excited about Mortal that. Mortal Kombat. <laughs> yeah. Nice. What's that? Mortal Kombat. I'm kidding. <laughs> it's Mortal a Kombat. it's Believable. a video game, Matt. Believable. You think it'll me. be better than the last one? <laughs> yeah. How could it? <laughs> <laughs> as cheesy and bad as that is, I've seen it like four or five oh, times. Oh yeah, I've seen yeah both of those old ones. I I haven't seen any of the Mortal insane. Kombat movies. They're good. They're I, what yeah, they are, but they're good. They're yeah. good if you like Mortal Kombat. That's what they are. Yeah. If you're like, you're like, this isn't the best movie, but because I like Mortal Kombat, I like this movie. If you can look past the terrible CGI dragon, then no. you're fine. I um I have seen the Street Fighter movie. Oh yeah. And fuck yeah. I don't particularly <laughs> like Street really Fighter, bad. but I love that movie because yep. of how fucking weirdly bad it was. And uh, yeah. the one guy. Who, uh, the guy that played Gomez in the Adams Family movies. Yeah, he was like his on his deathbed, but yep. he still was like trying very like hard, and he fucking sold it. He like yeah. fucking... he was like dying of cancer throughout the entire movie. And, uh, that's and what happens when you have cancer. Yeah, like you star in movies while you die. You're talking about that movie with like uh, it was like Jason Statham, and he had like shock himself or something. To say no, like. that's yeah. Crank. The Green Mile. Oh, yeah, yeah, the Green Mile. <laughs> Is, is Crank just altered Iron Man? No. 
he's, he's like, well, yeah, because well, he has the whole thing with the shrapnel I, trying to get to his heart, and that's like the main reason why he built this. And like, and since I have to have this, I might as well also have rocket arms. <laughs> well, but crank is because he had his organs actually stolen. Yeah, and he has to have so much like adrenaline to keep himself alive. Yeah, well, so he does like crack and. I couldn't tell you what well, happened in Crank 2. Movie. I watched it, and I have absolutely no clue what happened in it. I don't know if his organs got stolen again or what happened. He also, like, uh, just... No, fuck- it's, it's like, it starts off exactly where the first one ended. Oh, because okay. the first one, they... Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, like, falling from a plane. spoilers. Oh, he already said it. Uh, so. Sorry. I'm not listening. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, he jumps out of the plane, like, fighting the guy that took his organs, and then the second movie starts of them still in the air fighting. And- <laughs> oh, that good uh, fucking... <clears throat> Gandalf versus the Balrog. Yeah. Um, kind of. <laughs> I don't think that was what they were going to like, put those back to back and right. like sync up perfectly. I definitely saw the second movie, I, and the thing he also just like fucks his wife in public in yeah the first one. Yeah, so. in uh, Chinatown. Can we do it in the road. Exactly. You know, I'm digging this music. It's uh, it the Christmas Vince Giraldi trio oh, performing the Charlie, the Charlie Brown Christmas yeah. album. Fuck yeah. Yeah. Which Vince Giraldi is the pianist that uh, wrote penis. all the Charlie Brown stuff. Hell yeah. <laughs> Shut up. <Kurt. laughs> He's a whisper pianist. <laughs> like, I'm not sure if that even picked up. Hopefully. Uh, the reason I bring this up is you guys, are are you, per, would you be particularly upset if movie theaters just kind of like went away or if they were more like a super like special occasion sort of thing? Uh, I don't give a fuck about the movies, but... But my daughter fucking loves the movie theater. Mm. Mm-hmm. And then I, I appreciate it a little bit more when I'm with someone that is like, let's go see a movie. Right. I also generally, I think I do appreciate it more when I actually do go than I expect to. Like, I'm like, I could fucking sit at home and like have my own snacks at like Kroger pricing. Right. And then you go there and you're like, yeah, but this is an experience. It's nice. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's I have definitely have not gone to the movie theaters except... On the behest of, like, my <laughs> friends. Me. Yep. Uh, which is, like, it's a nice, like, thing to do, but since, like, if <clears throat> there are other, there's other shit I could be doing with my friends that's cheaper and, like, we could actually interact with, I guess. <laughs> well, would you uh, go see by yourself a uh, remake using Danny DeVito as the main actor in Frank? And he's like Frank from Always Sunny, but it's Crank. <laughs> I thought you meant the movie Frank. But it's what? Done with. Is there a movie called Frank? Yeah, y- it's oh, a good movie. Really there good. is a g- g- good movie called Frank. Oh damn it! Well, then that same scenario, but that. Oh <laughs> yeah, god! Danny DeVito is an outside like music artist, like he's an indie artist wearing a fake head. A giant fake head, so it's his tiny body with a giant. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I want to see that. I I'm not even sure how I could. Uh, describe Frank the actual movie in a summary. Um, yeah, it's uh, it, uh, an inspiring, terrible musician wanting to join this super underground popular band that doesn't exist, but at the same time does exist. Yeah, I've seen Scott Pilgrim. It's kind of like that, but like. If you Way like Scott Pilgrim, artsy. you'd probably it's, it's like the Frank. the plot of Scott Pilgrim. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. yeah well, there's this one guy who's kind of like a legendary underground music g- dude. And then there's this piano dude that, that shows up and he's like, oh, I need to be a part of this. And then he fucks it up because he wants to make like crappy pop music. Yeah. <laughs> also, it's Benjamin Button. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot like um, Castaway. Benjamin Button but with yeah. uh, Danny DeVito. Bingo. I, I'd watch it. He's Don yeah. Key has to weigh. So, uh, probably not <laughs> is the answer to that. When I watch Danny DeVito recast and crank. 100%. By myself at a movie theater. I, I, if somebody told me about this and nobody else wanted to go, I, I'd probably give it a, um, I don't give it a good thunk. I don't want to have a huge talk about it, but... In Scott Pilgrim, is him and Ramona actually the B plot? Because the thing progressing the story isn't his like relationship with her. It's trying to like progress the band. It's just that he keeps running into people that are associated with her. Uh, you know, 
he keeps incidentally running into her exes because they happen to be the bands that they are going up no, against. She, he, uh, he seeks out the skateboard dude. Uh, I can't remember his fucking name. Um, he, he actually goes and Skater finds him. Skater McGee, I think. Yep, that's it. Yeah. I think it's he like starts looking for him and then like just gives up because they end up seeking him out anyway, like finding him. So ah. yeah, because uh, the romance the romance is definitely like a part of like the a plot. Definitely, I think him like he doesn't. I I we won't harp on this too long, but in like the comics, it's definitely like the band is like all but forgotten by the end of it. On purpose, because Scott fucks everything up and breaks right. his bass guitar. How do you feel about this meme? <laughs> yeah, okay, sure. There's uh, there's definitely yeah. an entire generation of, like, weird nerdy guys and uh, super BPD, uh, bipolar disorder addled uh, chicks ready to, like, take advantage of them. Uh, no offense with anybody who suffers from a personality disorder or anything like that, but there's a there's a pattern I've noticed of like kind of socially awkward weird dudes who. <laughs> well, the person whose status I uh, but that's, threw that meme up also on wasn't that sinister said, from the Marvel universe. I, I don't know who that is. Some kind of villain. Kurt, do you want to read that off? No, under absolutely no circumstances are you Scott Pilgrim, and that poor girl on the bus is not your Ramona. Please take a shower. So Damn. yeah, no, that's that's completely fair. There's, the audience can see that. There's a lot of disconnected. Yeah, that's <laughs> see, that's purple over there. There's some vibrant stuff. There's Look, and now there's nothing. <laughs> Does that fuck with the video? Not yet. I mean, it'll probably help it. <laughs> it'll probably help it in the long run, but uh, well, I gotta turn it back on. Yeah, though. I know. I think there, I think there is a current of like geeky dudes and uh, quirky chicks that are uh, very, very, probably very awful for each other. Or there's also probably creepy dudes who are like, oh yeah, this is just gonna go exactly how I think it is. And I don't know. This is gonna be true love, right? Not. Yeah, yeah, it's weird. Yeah. <laughs> this the, will be. This is a. Uh, there's a. Uh, I don't. It's kind of a problematic song, but uh, th it's. I think it's kind of funny. It's a. Uh, it's called uh, Scott Pilgrim ruined a generation of uh, women, <laughs> and it's uh, we under no circumstances can we play it or like <laughs> do anything. But it's like super. It's almost got like incel energy to it like it's just this guy doing a really like angsty like har hardcore a really nice guy yeah <laughs> it's 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 very it's very dumb but it's a it's a funny song look it up i guess people <laughs> okay uh scott pilgrim derails again all right my bad <laughs> no it's uh do you do you ryan or matt have any opinions on the uh, concept of disappearing movie theaters. Uh, you want to go first? I'll go first. I, I don't really have a... Yeah, go ahead. All right. Uh, so <laughs> I don't give a shit about the big like AMCs and Regal Studios. Mm -hmm. uh, I definitely am that snobby dude that likes to go into like the arts, like cinema mm -hmm. over at the Fashion Mall because uh, they play way better movies. They'll so. they'll probably like come out the other end yeah, Fine. they'll they'll stick around just they, like that chili. But uh, mm. yeah, definitely like <laughs> chili. I would assume. Uh, but yeah, I don't give a fuck if AMC closes down because they are. I mean, I I I like going to those movies theaters as well. But I always have like terrible Less times fun. due to other people just like being rude in movie theaters and shit. Mm. And uh, hey, pass the popcorn. Guy. I don't care about the popcorn, but if you're just like talking the whole time and like on your phone constantly I'm not uh oh yeah into that because it's like i'm watching the movie but then someone like a couple rows down their phone will light up yeah like, and like, it's like, like that it's, every it's five minutes so dark that yeah. it's like no just turning your brightness down does not like yeah just, just don't have yeah. your phone out yeah the, the only reason i'll miss it uh is because the the sound like amplifies the feeling of the movie definitely yep but 
I guess I can Those just get a uh, get gazing. some fucking <laughs> but I'll be sound fine system. Going close. Yeah. You're right. Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> You're like, I would miss it, but also fuck them. Yeah. <laughs> I'll like, I'll movie <laughs> well, it's. I feel like people have gotten more and more like they go to movie theaters kind of more out of an obligation rather than like actually more being more broke. And I don't think the experience has really gotten much better. Like, well, I, I think also the experience is like after the movie, like you, everyone goes and yeah. does something else, and then talks about yeah, talks about the yeah. movie, and you can get a much larger group of mm-hmm. people going to a movie theater with much more seating than just your house. Yep. Right. Yeah. It's just weird that that's so a I social my interaction. Room into a theater for movie nights. <laughs> <laughs> Put a lot of seating in. Time to rent yeah, it out. <laughs> Remember when we all went to go see Dark Knight? At midnight, oh yeah. my god! But Remember also when we, we went didn't the go first night, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it was the wrong day. It was I, off by like a fucking month. It was yeah. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was that was yeah, yeah. Who dressed we up? Dressed as up. Who? We I dressed all, up as Penguin. Sarah right? was the Joker. Yeah, yeah, because you did two face. They gave me a pillow. I did two face. I did, I did, I did oh, two face. Yeah, let's explain this real quick. Like, Dark Knight was a big fucking guy. deal. Yeah, it was early. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> like just to, so no. We, we were really hyped on the release of Dark Knight, and we dressed up idea. in a, mm-hmm. it was probably about like a ten person group ish. Yeah, yeah. Uh, to go see it on release night. And somehow we just were way off on the day of the release. I mean, we the just captain. all showed up. How did we buy tickets? I oh, don't get, know. We, we well, that was actually time yet. that we didn't buy tickets. Yeah, like, that wasn't a time. There wasn't like, reserved seating. Yeah, when you go online and buy your tickets, that like you go in the place to buy your ticket. Yeah, but we did end up back in the good old like, days. Yeah, back, where, back in my day, <laughs> I, I don't fucking like that shit actually. But when you could dress up as characters in a movie theater, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> and not get shot. Oh no. Yep. Yeah, they yep. don't like that anymore. <laughs> Damn it. No, I'm that was just great. spud. <laughs> <laughs> These guns are props. They're not real. Um, this, this orange... No, I'm just Bucky. He always has his gun. <laughs> this orange hair is just a wig. Uh, they, they don't care if you have orange hair. Huh? Right here? Whatever. Man, things have gotten really <laughs> shitty. <laughs> Thanks, Corona. No, that, even before Corona, like, the whole, like... No, I meant the gut, beer. Yeah. <laughs> I'm dressed Mexicans. up as the Zodiac Killer. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Ted Cruz shows up in the movie theater. <laughs> yeah, the Zodiac Killer costume's in pretty poor taste, dude. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. <laughs> yep. Yep. Uh, have you guys uh, been feeling the holiday <laughs> spirit? Obviously, you have, Dan. You've got your tree. you got some presents for your, uh, I assume, children. Possibly just for you. It's uh. <gasps> You hung up lights outside our Ryan house. Over there. Hmm? Holy shit. What? But it's not time. No. Okay. Not quite. That's next week. No, it isn't. Yeah. It's no, the week after. Weeks to, yeah. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, next week's the 18th. Yeah. Next Today is Saturday dates. the 11th. 12th. 12th. Dates. This video will not <laughs> be up <laughs> tonight. <laughs> yeah. But that's when we recorded it. Cool. Anyways. Uh, at, at, uh, oh, are we doing it next week? 11 a.m. You think uh, Drake uh, Campagna is doing a Christmas cactus? <laughs> <laughs> you can't call him that. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we have to respect it. He's doing a Christmas bell. Do you think it's a for real name change? Like a legal name change? No. I, I think it would be uh, hard to do. It probably isn't because he didn't technically change his name. He's just pronouncing it a different language. Yeah. <laughs> well, and I, also I... Feel like he wouldn't be able to go to like an American court to get that legally changed without also having to turn himself in. <laughs> it also yeah. makes it way less silly that he now goes by, but it's still just Drake Bell. Because it's like to him, he's probably like, "Well, yeah, <laughs> 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 I'm still Drake Duh. Bell, just in Mexico, <laughs> <laughs> just in Mexico." I went ham on Christmas shopping this year. These dead spots are way more dead than we yeah. think because we have music, but there's right. not going to be music. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> that's, yeah. That's right. That's for you. You guys know what that is. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of hard going Christmas shopping while I'm on house arrest. Yeah. Because mm. I'm just scrolling through Amazon. I never got my fucking package tonight. Well, I got four of them today. So. I know. <laughs> I was expecting a goddamn package all day. 
and I kept getting Matt's fucking packages. <laughs> <laughs> the last one, I just wanted to be like, just take it back. <laughs> he doesn't live here anymore. He doesn't need this shit. <laughs> you keep it. But it's not for me. It's for somebody else. You cool. already got three. <laughs> huh? You got so many boxes in a day. Yeah, I did. Yeah, yeah and that's not even all of them. them. I've got like two or three come more today. coming. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, my God. I got a uh, Kabir Kama Sutra book. <laughs> oh, God. I told him he also needs to get him, like, a how to oh, be a yeah. father. <laughs> <laughs> like, here's present number one. You and should get him a rape it. whistle. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. For every time and he cross. doesn't think he's doing it. <laughs> right. Yeah. Maybe one of those uh, straws that change color if your, like, drink is, you know, spiked with drugs. <laughs> oh, yeah. Just so he can be sure. Yeah. So he doesn't get date raped. Yes. <laughs> or or drink person that's gonna date or, rape him or is drink himself. Xanax yeah. and lean. Yeah, he's gonna like <laughs> pour apple juice out of his own fridge into a glass and be like, hold on. It's like <laughs> let's get this party started. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't drugs? Yes. <laughs> Somebody's Damn gonna it. take advantage that. of and it's me. He just gets blackout drunk and drugs all his own drinks <laughs> in his fridge. And then later He's like, you're going to enjoy this later. <laughs> he gets a story God. out of it. He, I, he, he has such weird shit happen to him, and he just kind of takes it all in stride because I assume his whole life That's has just been this so way. That's why so about it. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's actually just like a Tyler Durden kind of thing. Yep. Tyler Durden. Yeah. Tyler Durden. <laughs> 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 Why? I am Tyler Dirty. <laughs> you want to fight about it? I am going to work today. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> That's the last thing he would ever say. What's the first thing he would say? Don't Let's talk fight. About no, he'd say don't talk about it. Uh, yeah, he'd say nothing. <laughs> hey, don't talk about it. The first thing he'd say is nothing, and that's also the second thing he'd say. <laughs> wow. Excuse me. What's the third rule, of Fight Club, Kerr? Taylor Dirty. <laughs> Always wash your hands. That's why they make yeah. soap. <laughs> <laughs> no sunglasses while you're fighting, though. I, I need to watch that again. I fucking... To find out what the third rule is. No, it's the wash your hands. That's why they make soap. Oh. I, <laughs> yeah. I, I fucking remember nothing about that yeah, movie. Yeah, they, they make lots of skincare. They make, like, soap and also some balm. Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, they do make A bomb. bath bomb. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Wow. I just remember the fucking bitch tits guy, and that's it about that movie. I bitch Paul? tits Bob, 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 Bob had bitch tits. Bob, 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 Bob Yeah, this is Bob. Bob, Bob, Bob has bitch tits or whatever. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> bitch, 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 bitch. This is tits. Bob's pancreas. Um, your stomach. Bitch, <laughs> 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 This is utter chaos. I again. What uh, are we talking about? I look dirty. <laughs> <laughs> your stomach is a section of your body, but it's also an organ inside that section. It's kind of oh. like when we say we're America, but we're actually just part of America. What? We're the only America that counts. <laughs> Yeehaw! <laughs> do you think? Uh, no. Do you think Canada's just sad all the time, or do you think? Well, they, those wacky guys over there. I know. Are they like? I mean, they like, got out on top. Above them, or do we trigger them? Right, no, right. they're definitely you know? above us. They're like the they're like <laughs> geographically we're speaking. We're like the the rebellious teenagers that kind of ran off, and they're like, well, all right. They're the do, guys do in their part 30s. Of you is still like, like, damn. Cool. Like, do you think if they're talking <laughs> right? to other people, like, oh yeah, I'm an American, and then like an American or a real American uh, comes in, and it's like <laughs> you're Canadian. I want to move what? to Canada. Yeah, it's, it's like dentists. They're like, yeah. well, I have a doctorate. That'd be <laughs> it's like, well, yeah, yeah. but. It's probably going to be the same thing. <laughs> you don't really count. But with, you know. You make a lot of money. Like, Free health care. Yeah. Well, actually, you have to wait four years if you move from uh, the US. United States. Or you can pay them a million dollars. To just. To just no, be Canadian. a citizen. 
And then All you right. have free health care, or you have to wait four years and have a, like an income of some sort. That offer I've, is yielded to celebrities. I've I've looked this up. People that need to get away. Yeah, I um, I'd like to become a citizen now. Yeah, why didn't Drake Campania fucking go over there? He doesn't like the cold. We already went over that. Yeah. Well, uh, fuck Canada. I mean, yeah. not all of Canada's if, if cold. I, if I had to move to either Canada or Mexico, and like it was the same kind of living situation. Canada. Canada. I, yeah, he's well I'd off over here. He's No, yeah, no, he's dude, rich over here, but he's like godly rich well, in Mexico. No, he probably, And people actually like him there. Uh... Well, yeah, and Mexico Maybe. isn't all shit. No, yeah, that's what I'm saying, but his money's like, going a lot farther in Mexico than it is nice in Canada. Spot. Yeah, good point. Wait, and all he has to do is pay off a well, cartel and guy. it's a fucking, like, like, there's spots that are, like, people vacation there. Right. Cancun. Who's the last person you heard of vacation to Canada? <laughs> Probably some, like, pothead that's really trying to get to <laughs> fucking uh, Amsterdam. Yeah, no, I think Smooge is the last person I knew Wait. who wanted to go to Canada. BC. I wanted to go to Canada. British, British Columbia? Yeah, Let Amsterdam. And the That's fucking in Netherlands. Canada. Buddy. Huh? Let's go to Vancouver. Let's go to Newfoundland. Vancouver Let's go to Letterkenny. Vancouver <laughs> has like three-fourths spring weather and then one month of winter. So let's go there. Why do they pay citizens to just occupy Australia, or Alaska? What, why do they do that? Yeah. So they have a reason to hold on to it. Like, I thought it was like because they like... Like Alaska's know, useless. Do, like oil rigging or some shit there. Yeah, there's like that, some like, stuff. There's, like there's beneficial shit to the actual. It'd be like, awesome to live in Alaska. Resources cool. of Alaska. Well, yeah. Yeah. No. Especially it, you can get paid. To that do one it. city where it's like daytime half the year and then nighttime the other. It's like, for, not it, like split in half where it's, it's like dark oh, yeah, all the like time. Three or four and then when weeks at a time, it's only three. Or, okay. Well, I can still I can still do that. That'd be sick. Yeah. That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, that would be until the vampires come. Ah. That's Whatever. where that's where that movie's located, right? Thirty yeah. days a night. Yep. Insomnia. No. The, the no. <laughs> <laughs> Thirty days of night. Taylor <laughs> Durden with a vampire. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Taylor Durden. Okay, Danny DeVito, but he plays the role that T- Brad Pitt plays. In Brad Pitt, not Fight Kristen Club. Stewart. In Fight Club. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say in like Snatch. No, that'd he... be pretty funny. He's the pike. Day the oh. Vito's the pikey. <laughs> I said periwinkle blue. <laughs> What's that movie? I with, said periwinkle with, uh, blue. Brad Pitt and he's like the like devil and he's like about to take away this like girl's dogs? father, but then he falls in love with the girl. <laughs> the camera's not adjusted Fuck. to his height. So it's just <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I want to oh, see Danny DeVito the play he's that just guy. Because he's farther away. Danny from DeVito him. should just replace Brad Pitt. I would love everything. It. Yeah. World War Z with Danny DeVito. Dope. Fuck yeah. Uh, what else Brad, Brad Pitt in Sunny in Philadelphia. No. Danny DeVito and Mr. and Mrs. Smith. I could see him. <laughs> <laughs> that would be I, so l- good. L- no, if, if he played like the character in Burn After Reading that he played, I could see that totally being a character in Always Sunny. Oh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Oh, that's a good point. The, yeah. the, the himbo, like... Uh, <laughs> yeah, the gym guy. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Uh, Did anyone see trainer. that movie when it came out? Which one? Burn After Reading. I saw it a while after, but yeah. I didn't get... Uh, Coen Brothers at that time. Yeah, that was like the I, first one, so I didn't know if it was supposed to be funny or not. I yeah, was, but if I they drop a new movie and the movie theaters are closed, you won't be able to see it until later. So you know that is Cole Gang Ho. You know that is Cole Gang Ho. Hey. All right, guys, we'll we'll be back with our Day DeVito podcast uh, a little later. Are <laughs> we still us, going? Uh, how long does this go? The later uh, part. This is the song that goes over because yeah. we always go over. Uh, it's okay. happened to kind of do it. Uh, 50 50. Um, yeah. Follow us where? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. <laughs> on Over YouTube. Rainbow. Oh, uh, Facebook.com. I was going to say, we should like, podcast. record this part so we just throw it at the end. Not right now, but like. Okay. That's not a bad idea. Can... <laughs> I want a donut. Fuck. <laughs> 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 Matt. Well, You've been uh, contributing a lot tonight. I appreciate it. Good. I like you. Things you got it, weird. dude. Yeah. 50 yeah. 50. What's that? Dark Slide. Yeah. Derek oh. Kennedy. Yeah. <laughs> I know now. Balance my grind. Yeah. 50. Tyler Dirk. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, Goodbye. we got Instagram. We got YouTube. We got Spotify. 
You you know what it well, is, that's Ho. Podcast. If that doesn't bring it to you, try like adding like a hyphen or something. In yeah. Random spots. The the YouTube URL <laughs> really sucks because we need subscribers. So fucking subscribe with every account that you have. Yeah. yeah smash that like button. Yeah, we're looking for more yeah. than two. Subscribe. Wait, I need to. I can do this. <laughs> yeah. Because I have a YouTube account. I don't remember oh, how we many. Get uh, to four I think we today. got like seven views maybe on YouTube. Oh fuck yeah! I but that's not like a full. It. That's not even a full watch. It's just like. Where the fuck is YouTube on my phone? There it is. Weird. Yes. You yes. know that it's cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's a funny thing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, this fucking raw Jokes. comical energy in this room right now is fucking overwhelming. Overwhelming.